Alright, here is how to make a point line and plane on the graphing calculator here. Inspire. So I'm going to turn it on and then go to new document, which is the first one. You can either press the middle here or the enter button. I guess I'll press the middle. I don't want to save. I want to add a geometry page. And now in order to pull up stuff we go to the menu button right here and we want points and lines so first thing I want is a point so I'll just go right here I want to label the point so I'm gonna press A there's other ways to label but that's the easiest way now uh, I want a line so I'll go press menu again go back to the points and lines this time I get line click right in the middle there click and then click again because two points define a line although it only shows me one and uh... this is not so easy to label so I, I won't worry about it now see up here it tells me I'm in the line tool if I want to get out of it I'll press escape and now I have a point and a line if I want to grab the line I can press control well, I need the open hand here. Press control and then the middle. And sometimes it doesn't work, so I press escape and try it again. Oh, I got it. So see my hand closed. And now I can drag that line around. Press escape. If I if I hit it on the point, if I grab it at the point, I wonder what'll happen here. Control click. Then it moves the line. Okay and then if I just click again it undoes it then we learned about planes too but if you go to the menu you don't see it just says points and lines well that's that's because planes you can't really draw but um we learned that you can represent them by parallelograms well that would be a little bit tough you have to construct in here but let's just use a rectangle so click 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 again there you go, point, line, and plane.